Welcome to this lesson on Porter's Five Forces related to McDonald's. In this lesson, we'll have a look at the four factors affecting McDonald's, starting off with power of suppliers. McDonald's has a low power of suppliers. This is due to their typically unskilled low income earners. They also have low switching costs as raw materials are beef and potatoes rather than the more complex components. The fast food restaurants also make bulk items, making their power of suppliers quite low. There are several ways suppliers can exercise pressure on buyers. They can raise prices, lower the quality of supplied materials, reduce their availability. That can be disruptive for normal business operations for several reasons. Price uncertainty results in an uncertain cost structure. How are we going to build long-term relationships with clients if we continue to raise prices because of constant pressure from suppliers? The quality of the supplied raw materials is critical too. It transfers directly into the quality of products. The moment customers notice we use low quality materials, their perception of the entire brand will change. Availability impacts our production cycle. If suppliers do not send the materials on time, this automatically results in a delay. So the next one is power of buyers. The power of buyers is high as they have minimal switching cost. Their threat of entrance is high, so for example, their burger restaurant startup costs are relatively low and not much expertise is required. In some aspects, they have low threat of entrance as it's difficult to establish a trusted brand name. The economies of scale, particularly purchasing, help to keep McDonald's costs low as well. The threat of substitutes medium as they're more upmarket burger restaurants, for example, Fat Burger, Five Guys, gaining ground in some time locations and also high as people are looking to more healthy options. We've also got the industry rivalry, which is very high as major industry participants such as McDonald's, KFC, Burger King compete heavily through advertising and aggressive discounts and low pricing. This is putting a, a lot of pressure on McDonald's as they need to ensure that they maintain their unique selling point. So if you have any other topics in mind that you would like me to cover, then drop it in the comments below. Thank you for watching.